tryna buy a home? You need a loan? HML got them loans on the go. If you need that hard money, then shot. Cause you know we your body. The Lions of HML Investments decided together we're gonna start a vlog. And the vlog is gonna be about hard money loans, private investments in real estate. You're gonna be the stars of the show. You're gonna show how to close deals. You guys are gonna teach people how to make money in real estate because you are the lions. And we're gonna explain the world and show them how easy it is to make money and how easy it is to create success in life as long as you focus and you are a lion in your heart. Are you ready? Ready! Yeah. If you need that hard money, then shot Cause you know we about it Trust these investors, hard money lenders, aight? We even got them commercial hard money loans Residential hard money loans And if you need a job, come to HML Cause we need some loan officers Bad credit, good credit, we could get you a loan So there ain't no reason not to invest in a home Long Beach or Malibu, HML got a loan to make it possible. Let's get started. Happy Monday to everybody at the HML Investments team. It's another week and we just started the fourth quarter. Like most people in the fourth quarter, they go to sleep, right? It's the holiday season. Most people take their foot off the gas and they literally go to sleep. But that means there's an opportunity for us to take advantage of the fact that everyone's asleep and we can keep closing more and more deals to end the year strong. I used to travel in December, November, December, but you know what? Every time that I went away, I became so busy. Like I started getting deals and more deals and more deals. And now I decided just to stay here and work hard because everybody else is gone. Uh, today, I want to talk about a couple things. Um, first, we have some new people that have joined the team recently. So I want to make sure they're up to speed with the loan programs that we have. If you guys checked your emails this morning, uh, I put in there three new flyers for you guys to use for marketing materials. So our single family bridge loan and fix and flip program, right? What is this for? This is for people who are looking to purchase single family homes that either need to close fast, they wanna do some renovations, or they need high leverage, okay? So our loan amounts are minimum. We're not gonna work on a deal less than 300K. Um, and we can lend up to 10 million on these properties. You know, we do this nationwide. So again, this is for clients that want to close quickly on a property. Maybe they just want to use it to buy the property and then they'll refinance after, right? Or if they want to fix and flip a property. So there is no minimum credit score requirement for our bridge loan and fix and flip program. Let's talk about the hard money loan program. This is my favorite program, guys, because with hard money loans, like we can close these in less than a week. But if you're going to sell a hard money loan, <laughs> You gotta make sure the client has at least 30 to 35% equity in the property or skin in the game. But guys, this, this is valuable, right? Not many people can get a deal and then fund it within three days or five days. That is like gold. That, there is a price to pay for that. That is value. The phrase is trailing 12 months. Office meantime. Wow. Yeah. 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 You need to treat every deal like it's the last deal you have and you need to be as creative as possible in order to make money from that deal. And to be creative, it's to research if he has other properties. You know, maybe the loan to value is a little bit wrong because the value that you estimated might be wrong. Maybe the value is a little bit higher. Maybe it's a little bit lower. If you feel comfortable, share with us the deal that you funded. Tell us the basic scenario and terms. We'll put it on the PowerPoint, we'll present it. So, and it's good because everyone can learn from the deal. The deal that funded last week was Armin. Congrats to Armin. There he is. We got this deal from a broker. We had never done deals with this broker before, but it was our first one he sent. Yeah, bigger uh, the hedge fund, yeah. you know, the less motivated we are to work with them. Because the biggest hedge funds normally takes forever and they're very regulated. It's like almost like conventional lenders. We don't like that because we're creative, you know, uh, loan officers. So yeah. we're trying to find investors or hedge funds mm -hmm. that are very small mm -hmm. and it's easier for them to make decisions. It's yeah. easier for them to fund the deal and faster because when it's fast, you can charge more money. Mm -hmm. You know, you can act faster and people like to work with you better. Yeah, we're salespeople. Yeah. We want to take information from them, mm -hmm. assess the situation, assess all this information that, that you're grabbing right mm -hmm. now from the person mm -hmm. and then know exactly what kind of a quote he should get, 
because mm -hmm. you know exactly who's going to be the lender, who's going to be the investor, mm -hmm. the hedge fund, the private family, you know, the family office, whoever you're going to uh, contact, you know already how it's going to be. But yeah. A lot of people, what they do wrong is they're, they're trying to, to master salesmanship by giving information and becoming like the best information teller, but it's the wrong thing. Hard yeah. money is a different territory. It you is. Know? It's a different mentality. Yeah. It's a different state of mind. Yeah. You know, a lot of loan officers that come from the conventional world, it's very hard for them to tap in the hard money world because the hard money is completely different. Here, you're like a cowboy riding a horse and you're in the wild, wild west because that's exactly <laughs> the way it is. Yeah, you know? the deal that I sent you, I yeah. get that a lot. And yeah. sometimes my investors will take them, but lately they haven't done anything. So maybe I just feel like I need to ask you for leads. Like how would we go about the leads? How, how I'll tell you what it is. Lately, a lot of investors, mm -hmm. they kind of like afraid to invest mm -hmm. because there is a lot of changes, drastic changes happening with the market the past month mm -hmm. and everybody's scared. So how do I start um, calling people? How do I start? So start with your existing network. I'll give you a script that you can, and I'll give you the flyers that you mm -hmm. can have at your disposal. Mm -hmm. So start with your existing network. Mm -hmm. Loan officers, conventional, yeah. mortgage brokers. I have attorneys, I like attorneys. Wholesalers, like attorneys, mm -hmm. CPAs, title mm -hmm. agents, escrow agents, right? Let them know that you do hard money thing. The lowest hanging fruit is in your existing network the, my, of influence. My, my agents right now. Yeah, the people you currently know, let them know, hey, do you have any investor clients that are working on deals that need help funding quickly, right? Yeah. You can help them win an offer by pr showing them that you have hard money and like cash to close quickly. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I got a deal on LinkedIn for two and a half million that we funded two months ago. And I messaged this guy, Cole, right? He was a more, it just said mortgage broker is his title. <laughs> he had no picture, right? Just said, hey man, great to connect. I see we're in the same industry. We'd love to see if we can add value to each other, right? Mm -hmm. He looks at my profile. It says, you know, private money lender, mm -hmm. DM me if you need funding in five to seven days. He says, great timing, Johnny. I have a client with a portfolio, blah, 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 blah. Here's the scenario. Ended up funding it. Last four or five years, I've done consulting mainly for startups, different types of companies, um, and I'm kind of looking to get back into an office, back into an environment where you know there's you know uh, caps and commissions, back where I can kind of just work for myself. Why do you want to start originating now? Because the origination part is completely different than selling loans in the secondary market. Mm -hmm. I mean, originally it's in my blood. You know, I'm, I'm really good. <laughs> you know, I've done it. I've I've done all types of sales. Nice. Um, I've worked with investors. I've worked with consumers. So I know both sides of the coin. I'm just. I feel like I'm naturally good at it. Why do I want to do it? I don't think it's a matter of why. It's just something that's that's it's my talent. That's that's what. I First have. of all, you gotta understand that if we make a decision that you're gonna be here, mm -hmm. it has to be like full commitment, mm -hmm. like no other side jobs or gigs. Mm -hmm. I'll tell you why. Because when you have other side jobs, you're not as focused as you should be in order to create massive success. You know, I don't want nobody to, to do like half-assed job when I give 100% out of myself. Because if we make the decision that you're here, then the whole team is committed to work with you, for you, so for your success. And if you give just like half of yourself or even 99% of yourself, that's not enough. If the opportunity is right for me, I will give it 110%. Um, I am the type of individual that um, I want to succeed and I want to be the best at anything I do. Yeah. So when I work in an environment, I strive to be the best salesperson. What type of opportunity am I dealing with here? What are some of your top guys making here? Top guys making you know, anywhere between 30000 a month mm -hmm. to probably 100000 to 150000 mm -hmm. It really depends you know, on on your commitment. I mean, the first like three, four months, five months, I do not recommend you to expect any pay whatsoever mm -hmm. because you're building your pipeline. Mm -hmm. But you're not, I've seen exceptions. Mm -hmm. In the beginning, the very beginning when I opened the company in 2011, I had a person that just dropped out of college. Mm -hmm. He came in to work for me. The first day, within two hours, he got a two and a half million dollar deal. We made $60,000 on it nice. four days later. Nice. The guy was blown away. He was like, whoa. He, de he didn't know how to even respond to this kind yeah, of money. So I've seen things. Yeah. You know, I had, a, I had a girl start working for me. I told her, listen, she never been in business before. She was a, a, a housewoman, like she was with her kids and everything. 
She came to the office and I was like, listen, I'm willing to give you an opportunity, but I'm letting you know right now, six months at least, you're not going to make any money. Mm -hmm. And within a month, that was like six years ago, within a month, she became the top producer of HMN. Nice. The top producer, like she had something like, I think 10 loans in the pipe. Um, how the hell did you get all those loans? Mm -hmm. She's like, I know people. Mm -hmm. You didn't tell me you know people when you <laughs> met me. Johnny, when he came in, he closed two deals his first month. Mm -hmm. His first month. For me, it took one year to close one deal because I was a little slower. I come from a different world. The things that I've been through made me realize that I learned a lot more about life, mm -hmm. which for me, it was a lot more important than just going to school. Sure. You know, school of life, for me, it was massive. Before we make a decision and jump the gun, I want you to think about everything that happened here today. Mm -hmm. It was a very short meeting, but I need, you know, I have other things to Absolutely. do. It's a Monday. Think if you're willing to commit like 2,000% mm -hmm. and to give it all you got like the first like three months at least mm -hmm. so we can prove you that you can really create a success mm -hmm. and if you decide that then I'm willing to give you an opportunity. I appreciate that. Sounds appreciate good? That. Yeah. But yeah. only like a thousand percent. I know exactly what you're talking about, what okay. you're looking for, Danny. Thank, Thank you. So Thanks much. for your time. All right. I'll we'll be in touch. Thank you so much. Bye.